both games were fights and you know we learned that when you go up to those places you have to start the game and you have to kind of win the fight first before you're able to pass and settle the game down and the Detroit game was a fight and our ability to respond and fight in the second half was a, was a great positive so we've continued to work on that on how we start games we practiced a lot this week we worked on set pieces they're really important in college soccer um, we're just giving this a little bit more edge, a little bit more excitement within our team. We won the ball really fast and then Joey played me the ball through and I saw the keeper stepping out a little bit and I just put it over him. Uh, it was very good, uh, great feeling. Unfortunately we lost that game though. You know, Finn's an interesting one. He's kind of, and this isn't to stereotype him because he's German, but he's kind of our Philip Lamb a little bit where, you know, if you don't know international soccer, he, I think he played every position for the German national team. Uh, Finn's kind of, kind of that guy. He's so honest and hardworking that I find, I seem to find a way to play him in a game. I'm looking forward to Sunday. The setting couldn't be better, I think. Uh, it's great to have the fans in the back and we're just hoping to win that. Uh, it's nice to be home. Um, you don't have the, the stressful energy of traveling a little bit, um, flying and going to a different place, a field you've never been. You know, we play on this field every day, so we know what to expect. We play in the, in the weather every day, so we know what to expect. Um, so all those things are great. It's nice to play at home and play in front of fans that are your own. Um, they sometimes give you that little extra ounce of energy. Um, in like 60th, 70th, 80th minute when you need it, they're there to push you. Um, so it'll be nice to play in front of a home crowd. And, you know, and represent the school right now.